This Adiyogi statue is in the process of getting ready. The idea is not to build Adiyogi fan club. This type of work is always best when there is a certain intimacy. I'm just crazy enough to assume this intimacy with every one of you. You are not here just to witness the consecration, you are participating in the concentration. So this is a yogi without a heart, no love affair, only yoga, inclusion, union. This dimension of just a look or a touch can send you into nameless ecstasies. On one level, we have enshrined that dimension into the yogis for a linga. This particular linga, has five chakras, each one of them has sixteen dimensions. Today in many ways he is complete with the Yogeshwar Linga in front of him. The significance of this is not in his size, nor in his beauty, but the energy that will propel him. We are in the process of Consecrating a yogish for a linga, in what way is it different? Why? When formless dimensions of existence take to a form, the geometry of that form determines how that particular form is going to function. I only wish that uh, every one of you actually see what's happening here. If you don't see, Things beyond physical nature, largely spiritual process will be just talking spirituality. Unless you really taste something, spiritual process will be an entertaining factor in one's life, will not become the mainstay. So making spiritual process the mainstay of one's life means that you have understood that source of life cannot be a sidetrack. But I want you to see something else, something beyond physical nature. If this has to happen, I want you on, focused. It should feel like one breath, one being. Then everything that's in my experience will become yours. I want this to happen. I want you to make up your mind that you want it to happen. This is a medium, this is a seed, this is a possibility which will move you from a compulsive state of logic to the magic of life. My blessing is, let something that you cannot understand, that you cannot grasp, that you cannot contain within yourself, let it happen to you. May you be overwhelmed by life. May you be overwhelmed by this tremendous phenomena that is creation and creator at the same time. The idea is to bring back spiritual process as a science, not as a philosophy, not as a belief system, not as a religion, but as a science. As there is a science and technology for external well-being, there is a science and technology for inner well-being. Did Adiyogi look like that? That's not the point. Is he an inspiration for you to turn inward? That's all the point. Hundred and twelve, because he offered one hundred and twelve ways in which a human being can attain to his ultimate way. Hundred and twelve ways, one hundred and twelve chakras which manifest in the physical body. To make subjective sciences part of everybody's life, that yoga is not an instruction, it is something that you live with. This has to become part of the world because 
in search of human well-being, we've done all kinds of insane things on this planet. But human well-being is one thing that's not happened, everything else has happened. Because if well-being is what you seek, in is the only way out, there is no other way. The next step is the Yogeshwara Linga will come on 15th of January. Of course, the Adiyogi statue will be ready by then.